What? Are we saying cuz? <laughs> so like, nah, hey. What to do with y'all reflections? It's your boy Spirit D signing in with another video for y'all. In this video, I want to talk about another one of the witchy tactics. Because in my last video, I told y'all about how, you know, a witch is always going to be a witch. Right? In this video, I want to talk to y'all about, you know, a major witchy tactic that a lot of people, a lot of witches out here be doing, a lot of bots out here be doing, a lot of witches out here, demonic entities, spirits, whatever you want to call it, right? In this video, I want to talk to y'all about the are you okay method in terms towards the witchy creators, all right? The are you okay method, all right? What to do with y'all though, look. Your boy Spirit D, he got the Amethyst in this joint. Amethyst, however you pronounce that joint, honestly, I don't know. I just know that my intuition be on fleek already. But then when I got my crystals on, like, that shit is, is game over, nigga. Well, look. With all that being said, I need y'all to like this video if it resonates with you or, or if you have been through this situation before, I need y'all to comment under this video and tell me y'all stories, tell me all y'all, you know, examples and times that a person has done this to you. Cause before, look, I'm about, it's about to get interesting. Before I get into this though, like I said, I just want y'all to let me know down below, all right, if y'all have been through this shit before. And I know y'all have, I know y'all, I know a lot of y'all can relate. If y'all have light inside of you and y'all some spiritual, high spirit vibrational beings, y'all, y'all know what I'm talking about, all right? Now, here we go. The are you okay method, all right? A lot of witches out here is going to, you know, like I said, people out here be shape-shifting and shit like that. I've said that in my previous videos. People be shape-shifting, all right? So, like, you know, a person could be on a low vibration, a, lo a person that's vibing low, you know, they could be, you know, in their right mind at one point, and then at another point, that demon could just hop into them, that witch can just hop into them real quick, and then they ass just get to, you know, acting all funny and shit. You know what I'm saying? And guess what? The, t the, the main times, one of the main times that that these entities will hop inside your body and, and snatch, your soul, snatch your body and just, you know, take over your vessel, and not your vessel, but you know the witch's vessel, the opposition's vessel, the, the the demonic spirit, the demonic entity's vessel, right? When these when these uh, demons will hop inside other people's bodies and vessels, it's when you're vib vibrating at one of your highest. All right, I'm gonna say it again. One of the main times that demonic spirits will hop inside of a human's vessel is when you are on one of your most highest moments your most high vibrational moments all right when you is like at your fullest potential and you just feeling yourself to the max all right <coughs> so look y'all understand this all right it'll be times when you know you may have done your working out you had got your push-ups going in your lifting your weights you're going to the gym whatever you may have went for a good good little jog real quick. You know what I'm saying? Shit, fuck it. You could have not even exercised. You could just be reading books. You could just be feeling good and tapped in, right? Real tapped in, right? You have to be careful and protect your energy because, you know, and, and, and it sucks because some people are just forced in these situations. They have to be around, you know, low vibrational beings. They have to, you know, until they can get themselves out of that situation and out of that circumstance. But... You know, for the ones that have the choice and the option to move around these low vibrational beings, you need to move around. Try your best to stay away from them as much as possible. I know some of these folks you love, all right? But, you know, you still got to love them from a distance. It just is what it is nowadays, the time, the time and present time that we is in now, all right? Especially for you high sensitive beings that have high, high intuition and high empathy for people that, that can feel energies, you know, and know how people feel in the moment. You gotta, you gotta protect your energy, man. This is, you know what I'm saying? Like this shit ain't no game. All right. So look, 
when you are vibing at your highest potential, right? At your highest and you just feel good. You know what I'm talking about when you just feel real good on the inside, right? You just feel real good on the inside and you know, you feel like you on top of the world. Can't nobody stop you. Can't nobody take you off your game at the moment, right? When you was in that moment, when you was feeling like that, when you were on that frequency, if you go around a low vibrational being, all right, and they're already like agitative as it is, all right, especially if they're already agitative as it is and they're already not fucking with your energy and shit like that, shit, when you go around low vibrational entity, it could be in public, it could be in your household, it could be, you know what I'm saying, anywhere. When you go around these low vibrational beings, they go, sometimes they may hit you with the, are you okay? <laughs> are you okay? Hey, hey, come, come here. Are you, are you, are you sick? Are you, they, they try to do that witchy ass witchcraft shit on you. This is what I'm talking about when I say witchy tactics, all right? When I say witchy tactics, and, and by the way, shout out my man's track beats, because he the one that made up the word witchy. I ain't even gonna hold y'all. I ain't gonna take away his, his shit. He the one that made up the, the word witchy. So y'all go follow that nigga. That's my home. That's my homie right there. You know what I'm saying? But look, these people will ask you dumbass little questions like, are you okay? And they'll say it in the most, like, they'll try to hide their energy. Sometimes they'll be like, are you okay? Like, they'll try to be all nice with it. All quote unquote nice. Fake ass nice shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't read that shit. And then sometimes they'll try to act really concerned like, are you okay? Just to try to act like the the vibration that you're in is not a good vibration. Just to try to make put a try to gaslight your ass and make you feel like you are wrong and like you're not supposed to, you know, be feeling like that. You know what I'm saying? And the only reason they're doing that to you guys is because they don't like how they're feeling. They're not okay. They're the ones that are not okay. You see what I'm saying? They'll ask you if you are okay because they are not okay. You know what I'm saying? So if anything, you need to ask them, are you okay? All right? Shit, are you okay, my dude? What, what, what do you mean am I okay? You can't tell? You can't tell, baby. You can't tell that I'm vibing high? Like, what? What? What are you saying, cuz? What? What? Like, bro, I'm, look, listen, listen. I walk in the joint. I done got done doing my pull-ups, my dumbbell pull-ups, my push-ups, my, you know what I'm saying? I'm feeling my muscles. I'm feeling good. You know what I'm saying? I walk down to the scene feeling good i'm smiling like i'm smiling like listen guys i if you know then you know it be times that we gotta like hide our energy so we feel good on the inside you know majority of the time but you know we gotta hide our energy out here you know what i'm saying around certain demons and entities so we're not always gonna have a smile on our face you know what i'm saying we be on our serious time it don't mean that we looking all mad like we about to fight you but we are we do be looking serious all right we do be on serious time listen it'll be folks out here it'll be those days that you feeling real good and you'll finally come out your shell right you'll finally come out your shell and maybe give a little you may be feeling a little good so good that you might smirk you might smirk a little bit you might give that little smile you know what i'm saying just so just because you thinking, you thinking in your head, like, okay, let me go ahead and just give some leniency to these demons real quick and show them that I'm happy and maybe we can get a high vibrational conversation going on, all right? You know what I'm saying? You you sometimes try to, and this is why you got to not show no leniency to these fucking witches, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, low vibrational beings, they will try to confuse you and play with you. This is why I said a witch is always going to be a witch. You know what I'm saying? This is why I said in my other video, show love, but don't show no mercy. We're speaking of that, by the way. I searched up mercy, the definition, the full definition. Fuck these motherfuckers that made the dictionary, man. Because the, the way, the definition that they put for mercy is some bullshit. <clears throat> I didn't know that that was the actual definition. So, I can't, I, I, I'm going to make another video later on in the future in regards to that. Because, you know, it's not necessary that you're not supposed to show no mercy. Because technically, mercy means compassion and loving for others and all that. And you're supposed to show that. So, I don't want to get y'all confused thinking that, oh... When I say show no mercy, you're not supposed to you're not supposed to show compassion and forgiveness. No, you have to forgive. You have to forgive before you you got to forgive everyone on this universe before you can move in your divine nature. All right? But like I said, I'll give y'all a future video on talking about that. It's still the intentions behind that video is still real. It's just the title that's fucked up, all right? <clears throat> but anyways, listen. You may finally give 
you know, uh, being a little smirk because you feeling so good on the inside because I'm happy. You feeling good today, right? And they going to try to really ruin your mood by hitting the, are you okay? And I'm not saying, guys, like you supposed to let it get to you, but God damn, like, am I okay? You don't ask me if I'm okay when I'm looking like this. You don't ever ask me if I'm okay when I'm looking calm and, you know, laid back. And you don't ever ask me if I'm okay when I'm having spiritual warfare with your ass. Huh? What the fuck? You don't ever ask me if I'm okay when I'm having spiritual warfare with your ass and I'm feeling your energy and I'm feeling all the, the, the low vibrational thoughts that you're process, processing and trying to attack me with and consume me with. You don't ever ask me if I'm okay then. You see what I'm saying? But... When a nigga feeling good on the inside, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like, like two, 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 let's go, you know what I'm saying? Like, when a nigga feeling good on the inside, you don't ever ask if a nigga okay then. I mean, when a nigga feeling good on the inside, you gonna ask me if I'm okay. Like, what? What are you saying, cuz? Are you, are you okay? What? What? Are you okay, cuz? Are you okay? What do you mean it? What are you saying? Oh man, let me calm my energy down. Oh man, I'm feeling good out here. Look, on this great grand rising dog, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling blessed, y'all. You know, the, the energy is on this planet. Uh, what's it called? The karmic energy is about to come. It's like, we coming in, it's a Monday, you know what I'm saying? We coming in the June. Like, bro, I'm feeling great. I'm about to, I'm on, I'm on a social media fast right now. You know what I'm saying? So, this video is probably not going to be uploaded till later. But, listen guys. I just wanted to talk to y'all about that tactic. Watch out for shit like that. And, you know, move how you want to move. I don't want to tell you guys, oh, retaliate back and be like, are you okay? It's up to you. It's up to how your energy and what your where your intuition tells you to do. How you feeling in the moment. If you want to just walk, just be like, look, you can just ignore it. If somebody asks you if you are okay and you got a smile on your face and you feeling good, or you just feeling good and you know that they, they know you feeling good, you don't even got to answer that question because that can just lower your frequency and engaging into that. You know what I'm saying? Or you can reverse psychology that motherfucker and be like, are you okay? Like, what? Are, are you okay? You're not looking too good right now, cuz. Like, like, what are you saying? Like, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you can switch that bitch up on them real quick, ask them if they is okay. Make them feel whatever they was trying to make you feel, but I don't, I don't recommend that either because, like I said, like you, you know, you gotta not engage all the time and on their frequency. You're not supposed to really be on their frequency, but if you know you're coming from a place of love when you say that to them and and and, and joy and laughter, then it's okay. Like me, I'm, I might hit the, yeah, I'm like. Like, when someone asks me, I'm not going to lie. Okay, example for me. Someone's asked me if I'm okay. I'm not going to say no names. But someone has asked me if I'm okay, you know, when I'm feeling great. And I was like, like, normally I would be like, if I'm angry or something like that, I'll be like, yeah, I'm fine. Like, real quick. But I, I breathe real quick because this has happened to me in numerous, more than 10 million times already. So I already know how to, you know, control this shit now. But, um... When I was asked, the, the recent time, that the, the latest time that I was asked, are you okay, when I felt good as hell, you know what I'm saying? Um, what I did was I just like paused for a second, controlled my temper, and was like, walked up, you know what I'm saying? I was like, I, I'm, I am great. Are you okay? How about yourself? No, that's what I said. I am great. How about yourself? You know what I'm saying? Like, But I, I didn't say it how I just said it right now. I said it in like a more high vibration. Y'all know what I mean, guys. I said it in a more loving for way because i felt good in that moment so good that even that person asking me even that entity being asking me if i was okay it didn't bring me down at that time like it didn't make me be like what what are you talking about dude because i've been i've been tested like that so many times so i'm used to this shit but for some of you guys that are just now coming to see your power you probably are just now going through shit like this you know what i'm saying so that shit could be a little eerie to you so Understand now you know what one of the tactics that people are gonna come at you with. So now you gotta just move around and figure out how you gonna come back at it. If you just gonna ignore it, brush it off, like, or if you gonna come at them, you could be in a serious. You could actually be like, yeah, yeah. You could actually like just be serious and upfront with them, honestly, because that's really what, what we need to be nowadays. Is very honest and just straightforward with shit. Um, yeah, I'm good. You don't see the smile on my face. 
<laughs> like what you talk and just laugh it off. So then, so then they can still feel that you still coming from a place of love. You know what I'm saying? You're not just coming from, you're not coming from an anger or nothing like that. You just coming from a like smart ass mentality. Like if you ask a dumbass question, I'm gonna give you a dumbass response. You see what I'm saying? Something like that. But with all that being said, man, I will see y'all in the next video. It's your boy Spirit D. Listen, I just had to let y'all know one of the witchy witchy ass craft tactics that these witches will give to you. It's gonna ask you the are you okay question. Like, are you okay? Like, are you okay, sir? How you, you look a little sick, but shut what are you saying, cuz? You 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 can't read energy or something, cuz like you, you can't read energy. You, 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 your intuition fucked up. Like that's what we really wanna say. You know it. Like that's what you know what I'm saying? But look, with all that being said, y'all, I will see y'all in the next video. Y'all have a great grand rising, wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. Stay in divine order, stay in alignment, stay in vibration, and stay on your frequency. All right? Don't let nobody knock you off your focus. It's your boy Spirit D signing out. Love, fam. Love, fam. Love.